Unless, unless proven otherwise, I think we're really wise to err on the side of caution. And I'm just going to remind you something, Alex, just because I know that, you know, this is this is something that um, creates a kind of a clear line of for for analysis, and that is 911. Now. If you believe that you know the buildings can fall straight down at free fall speed, and and uh, you know that the the guy was able to fly the plane and hit the Pentagon with no debris, okay, God bless you, just go your way. Those of us who see these events as self-evident, right, that this was simply an operation by the government, then we have to understand that we are living in the world that has been created by the MKUltra science and technology, right? MKUltra didn't disappear. When the church commission asked to have all of the documents, Helm said, you know what, I destroyed them. And they said, why? And he goes, I didn't want to embarrass my friends, right? So, so this, and then he continued on as head of the CIA. So you can see that democracy is just a facade, um, that the overall project of mind control has continued unabated, and we are now uh, suffering as, you know, uh, as, a, as a nation underneath its boot heel. So when, when, you know, we talk about, well, could there be some justification based on, you know, the, an, a uh, technological arms race with Russia? It's irrelevant to me, Alex. I don't care. Sure, who cares? What is important is that the organization has never been brought to sunlight. And it's, it's, it's when people ask me about, well, what about the, um, uh, you know, the spiritual potentiality of psychedelic drugs? I just say, look, that isn't on the table. What is on the table is that there is an organization that has been using these things against us. And until, until that has been brought completely to sunlight, then all of these attributes that have come out of their manipulation of culture have to be stopped. I mean, we just have to stop right now, freeze in our tracks, and we have to do the investigation of what is inside the government, and then we can make decisions about, well, is this a good cultural idea, or is there something to worry about from Russia or the Chinese? But right now, the problem is inside the government. It's what controls it. That's what we've got to focus on. We can get to all these other issues later. I, I'm not opposed to any of you know, these ideas. I'm just saying that it's not really something that we need to deal with immediately. What we've got to do right now is we've got to focus on what's controlling our government.